SpaceX continues to shock the rocket industry with its unconventional approach to orbital launches, and now the company has once again set the standard of what a commercial spacecraft should perform like. The Falcon family of rockets has cemented its place as the most reliable orbital launch vehicles active today, but how did it get here? Let's take a closer look. Have you ever wondered how a company can transform the seemingly unattainable into a regular occurrence? SpaceX has accomplished precisely that by pushing the boundaries of space exploration, envisioning a world where rocket launches and landings become as commonplace as airplane flights. This is the reality that SpaceX is actively shaping. The journey of SpaceX, featuring the development of its Falcon 9 and Falcon Heavy rockets, was characterized by significant challenges and notable setbacks, especially in the initial stages. In the beginning, the aerospace community expressed considerable skepticism towards SpaceX's ambitious plans. This skepticism primarily stemmed from the inherent high risks and financial uncertainties associated with the development of reusable rockets. One of the most remarkable failures SpaceX faced was the explosion of the Falcon 1 during its first three launches. This setback posed a severe threat to the company's financial stability and almost led to bankruptcy. However, SpaceX persevered, and the pivotal moment came with the success of the fourth launch of Falcon 1 in September 2008. Nevertheless, the development of Falcon 9 and Falcon Heavy remained a high-stakes endeavor. The Falcon 9, which took its maiden flight in 2010, encountered a significant setback in 2015 during the CRS-7 mission, intended to resupply the International Space Station. Unfortunately, the mission ended in failure as the rocket exploded shortly after liftoff. Undeterred by these challenges, SpaceX persisted in its commitment to innovation and technological advancement. In the face of setbacks, SpaceX made continuous improvements, leading to a notable achievement, the successful relaunch of a Falcon 9 rocket in 2017. This event marked a significant milestone in aerospace history, showcasing SpaceX's resilience and determination. The Falcon Heavy, introduced in 2018, had its own share of challenges. Initially scheduled for launch in 2013, it faced repeated delays due to design modifications and technical obstacles. Despite these hurdles, the successful test flight of the Falcon Heavy represented a major accomplishment for SpaceX. It demonstrated the company's capability not only to launch heavier payloads into orbit, but also to extend its reach beyond our planet. Presently, both the Falcon 9 and Falcon Heavy by SpaceX are setting and breaking records consistently. These rockets play integral roles in a wide range of missions, including satellite deployments, cargo resupply missions to the International Space Station, and even crewed missions. Consider a recent Falcon 9 launch, which stood out as a dual-purpose mission involving the deployment of both Irish and South Korean satellites. What made this launch particularly noteworthy was its historical significance. It marked the 250th successful landing of a Falcon rocket. SpaceX's unparalleled track record leaves other companies and agencies trailing in its wake. The Falcon 9's first stage, designated as B-1061, achieved its 17th flight during this mission. Notably, it had previously supported high-profile missions such as Crew-1, Crew-2, and several transporter rideshare missions. Remarkably, this launch represented the first instance where a Falcon 9 first stage with over 15 previous flights supported a non-Starlink mission. This underscores SpaceX's confidence in the reliability and reusability of its technology. What does this mean for space exploration? It marks a paradigm shift. The precision and reliability of the Falcon 9 go beyond merely delivering payloads into orbit. They are about consistently achieving controlled landings, a feat that seemed unthinkable just a few years ago. The reliability demonstrated by SpaceX's Falcon 9 and Falcon Heavy rockets is opening up new possibilities for more frequent and diverse space missions. Elon Musk doesn't just see these achievements as milestones, he views them as crucial steps toward a larger vision of making humanity a multi-planetary species. SpaceX's impact extends beyond its technical accomplishments. The company has revolutionized the space launch market. Consider the numbers. SpaceX has successfully completed 88 orbital launches with its Falcon 9 and Falcon Heavy rockets, a staggering figure that accounts for nearly half of the world's total flights. This dominance becomes even more apparent when examining payload mass. In the first 34 launches of the year alone, SpaceX deployed over 1,000 metric tons of payload into orbit, with approximately 80% of this dedicated to expanding the Starlink broadband network. In the year 2023, SpaceX has launched a total of 90 rockets, comprising 84 Falcon 9S, 4 Falcon Heavies, and 2 Starships. Notably, the company has maintained an impeccable 100% launch success rate, the cumulative payload mass deployed so far stands at approximately one 
2 million kilograms. Furthermore, SpaceX has achieved a remarkable 100% landing success rate with a total of 90 successful landings throughout the year. This year's launch frequency builds upon the record-breaking performance witnessed in 2022. In the previous year, the Falcon 9 rocket, in particular, set a new standard by successfully completing 60 launches within a calendar year. This accomplishment holds significant importance for various reasons, not the least of which is the fact that it shattered a long-standing record that had been in place for over four decades. The prior record held by the Soyuz rocket involved 47 launches, with 45 of them deemed successful back in 1979. SpaceX didn't merely break this record, they significantly surpassed it. Among all of SpaceX's launches, the Starship stands out as the most significant, towering over 400 feet tall and propelled by 33 engines. This colossal spacecraft represents a monumental leap in rocket technology and plays a crucial role in NASA's Artemis program, which aims to return humans to the moon. However, despite its impressive stature, Starship faces vital tests, including reaching orbit and enduring atmospheric re-entry. Starship is currently preparing for its next test flight, expected to be ready soon. Elon Musk has indicated that the hardware for Starship Flight 3 should be prepared for flight within three to four weeks, pending final production of the necessary components. The actual launch date, however, hinges on obtaining a launch permit from the Federal Aviation Administration, FAA, which is overseeing a SpaceX-led investigation into the previous failed mission. The FAA's approval is crucial for the progression of the third flight. The second flight of the Starship, similar to the first uncrewed test flight in April, ended explosively. Despite the explosive conclusion, SpaceX engineers still deemed it a success, as the mission achieved important milestones such as stage separation and an extended flight duration compared to the initial effort in the spring. The SpaceX team has observed a notable improvement with the newly designed launch pad, which can comfortably handle the colossal 17 million pounds of thrust generated by the Super Heavy, almost double the thrust of NASA's new Space Launch System rocket. This advancement signifies a significant leap forward from the previous launch pad, which succumbed to the immense force and pressure exerted by the Super Heavy's 33 Raptor engines during the launch in April. While SpaceX's ultimate goal is to employ the Starship for crewed missions to the Moon, Mars, and beyond, extensive testing is still a prerequisite. The company is committed to achieving a greater frequency of test flights, aiming to expedite progress toward this ambitious objective. Starlink, another of SpaceX's ambitious projects, has set its sights on providing global internet coverage by 2023. Projections indicate that SpaceX is on track to roughly double its revenues to approximately $8 billion, with Starlink potentially contributing up to 40% of these revenues, translating to around $3.2 billion. This revenue is primarily derived from service subscriptions in residential, business, and mobility segments, along with hardware sales. The active subscriber base for Starlink is anticipated to double, going from an estimated one. One million in January 2023 to around two. Two million by the end of the same year. Looking ahead, SpaceX's ambitions show no signs of slowing down. The company aims to significantly increase its launch frequency to an unprecedented level, envisioning a future where SpaceX conducts 100 flights within a year. This target, once deemed unattainable, reflects not just a numerical increase, but a relentless drive to push the boundaries of what's possible in space exploration. Do you think SpaceX can continue to increase its launch cadence in the coming years? Please share your thoughts in the comments below.